Hi guys, it's Courtney again, and I just wanted to show this little one to you, um, or just showing you what I'm working on. This is, um, oh no, let me think. This is Ezzy by Sherry Williams, and cutest, cutest little thing. I'm not 100% satisfied with the eyes. Um... So I'm thinking about changing them out. I'm not sure. But, I mean, he's still, he's definitely not done yet. I gotta do the inside of his mouth. And he still needs more coloring uh, here and there. But, um, I'm hoping to have him possibly done before the doll show. Because I should be able to finish up his painting in the next week. And then it takes Claudette about a week or a little bit more to root. So I'm going to ask if she can squeeze him in, but I th I'm thinking, um, even if she doesn't, hmm, I'm, I'm undecided, I'm thinking that even if she doesn't get around to reading him, I might still take him and do, like, maybe just a show of him, like, if somebody wants to buy him and choose the hair color, you know, um, or if somebody just wants to buy him bald, uh, I'm, I'm undecided, I'll have to, I'll have to think about it, but, I mean, his painting on this bald head looks really good, so, I mean, someone probably be happy just to get that. <laughs> you know, some people like bald babies, but let me show you that, and I'm also going to show you um, his limbs, because, unfortunately, he's a boo-boo baby. Now, when I purchased this kit off of eBay secondhand, um, I was not happy because the, the seller lied. I mean, she had to have lied. You know, I know people are not all knowledgeable about silicone but she said his only defect was um was that he had some discoloration between his limbs and that was just absolutely not true um he was a mess thankfully it it's not thankfully it's not like damage that can get worse over time it's just damage that came from his molding his like his pore job was um, not done well it may have been a first pore or something uh, let me show you this hand right here. Sorry, I'm pulling off the thing. Um, this hand here, uh, you can see like the little his his fingers almost looked like they'd been um, getting pruny in a bathtub, <laughs> kinda, and like there and the, his thumb is flat and a couple of his fingers are flat. See how flat his thumb is. And um, he has an armature in this arm, by the way, which is really cool. And no, his panty's not done, so please be forgiving of how this looks right now. But, um, I don't know, his fingers are a little off. I'm trying to paint him to so it's not, um, it's just not as noticeable. And so I'm hoping that comes through. Uh, and this is this one. And then the other one, um, my little thing that I rig here. This way. Oh, well, which way are you gonna hang? That way? Okay. Nope. Sorry, this is such a pain. <laughs> Alright. There we go. Alright, and then this one. Um, is it you? Oh, okay. So, like, these little spots, like right here, see where it's sticking out of the wrist right there? Um,. There's a couple, like, there's one spot on this arm, and then there's a couple spots, um, on one of the legs. And I'm just trying to turn that into little baby acne looking, so I'm gonna paint it accordingly. Um, but this hand is, is fine. Like, there's nothing wrong with the hand. Um, but it's like one hand, or one arm and one leg are, are mostly, um, defective, but the rest of it is great, and so I'm, I'm trying to just work with it, but this, none of these little boo-boos are going to affect, like, long-term with the silicone. It's nothing, nothing's going to tear, nothing's going to, um, oh, nothing is going to, uh, peel or anything like that, so that's not really an issue. It's just cosmetic. Like, this leg was great. There was nothing wrong with this leg. It was perfect. No flaws. Um, yeah, so that one's great. But then this leg, here, has more of the little, like, baby acne. So you can see, I kind of started trying to do the little baby acne there. 
um, but and then on top of the leg right here it looks so much better with paint but can you see like the little I mean there's some baby acne on top here but there's like little um, holes kind of where it the silicone just looked rough you see can you guys see right there um, and the top of the leg like when I first got it looked at it, I'm like this looks like it's been like the baby was burned like it just had this almost like a burn scar look to it but the painting has covered it like 90 95 percent at least and you really don't notice it unless you get really up close like I showed you so thankfully for the most part um, it's covered but it's just disappointing uh, I was at a point where I didn't feel like arguing the case of it and so but it, I mean it's really a shame I probably should have because um, I mean, I'm gonna sell them sell them at a boo-boo price uh, and you know but for what I pay for him basically for what I pay for him I'm not gonna get much in return especially for you know all the supplies that will go get put into him but he's still extremely adorable I love this kit um, I love that he has an armature in one of the arms I think that's um, where it can come up so he can suck his thumb and he's got I mean he's his sculpting is adorable and for the most part his his uh his casting was great it just happened to be um, you know I don't know like I talked to his original artist after I got her you know got him and and she like thoroughly apologized she said that she doesn't that's why she doesn't like selling or, or giving away boo-boo kits to anybody for this reason but I mean this was not her fault at all this was the seller's fault for not disclosing if I had known I either would have not purchased him or I would have requested that he come at a cheaper price um, but you know it is what it is <laughs> and uh and I don't, you know, I don't fully regret because he's really cute and it's also, you know, continued uh, practice work for me. And I'm very happy how his coloring's turning out. And I'm thinking for him, I thought about giving him dark, like a little bit, a little bit wavy hair. I think it'll be really cute for him, especially if he's going to keep these brown eyes. They're growing on me. <laughs> but anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed watching this video and we'll see you in another one very soon. Bye.